What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Grocery Store Simulator. Last episode we got some new items in here, leveling up the store to level 8 with our store. And um, again, adding some new items here. We got basically all these right here, new shelf of that. We got some new drinks mixed in here as well. And then also we've got our new peppers in here. And today I've got a plan, a little bit of a plan. Actually, I was looking at uh, some of the items that we have for the store. Um, we have this um, small wooden shelf, which I believe is for fruits and veggies. So we're actually going to try and order one of these. And we are going to actually place this over in the corner, right over here, to get us some extra space for our veg for our fruits and veggies. Maybe our bigger ones. We will see on that. But if you guys are enjoying this, be sure to drop a like in the video. Show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around you're checking us out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But, um, yeah, so we're going to continue on where we left off again and uh, keep on rolling with things here. I believe this is for fruits and veggies. Oh, we can sneak that in there. Okay. Um, maybe it is. I don't know. <laughs> it's not looking like it now. It looked like... Because there's like a small shelf normally, but that's just maybe just like a nicer looking shelf. So we might have just screwed that one up, but that's alright. We will uh, see what we can do with this. Does that... Yeah, it needs to be on a fruit rack, so that is just a normal shelf. Unfortunately. Um, well, that's a bit unfortunate. Does that work for this? Yeah, it does. Okay. Now I, was kind of, now I almost kind of want to swap all these out to like these. Because these actually look like really nice shelves. So I mean, we're going to keep the shelf. I guess we'll just keep it placed there. Keep it as a placeholder to fill in that space so it doesn't look as goofy. But um, yeah, we're going to open up the store. Then we got another storm rolling in here. Seems like we get a lot of storms in here now. But um, yeah. Again, we're working towards getting our next um, store level yet again here. Which is going to be $3,000 that we need to get to level 9 for that. Which with that, we will, we will unlock... Just saw red. Okay, cabbage, banana, avocados. Yeah, we're all good on those. But um, yeah, that'll unlock more energy drinks, garden peas, orange uh, marmalades. Kind of like an orange, um, like can't think of the <laughs> can't think of the word. Peanut butter. We got a hazelnut spread. Oh, that's actually the final level from there. So it's just a few new things. Only the four, but um, like a jelly type of thing, like a, a jam. Yeah, a jam. That's what I'm looking for. Um, for that. So. There we go. We got uh, 39 bucks back for you. Thank you. Thank you there, ma'am. Yeah, it is... I think I'll use my credit card. It is so loud. And then I turn it down one. It's just like, okay, I, it's next to nothing then. So I can barely even hear it. But, um, yeah. I appreciate all the love and support you guys are showing on the, the last episode of this. It's absolutely killing on the channel. So thank you so much for that, honestly. It means the world to me. And um, especially, I know I've mentioned this before, things are kind of a little bit crazy right now for the time being as far as where I'm, I'm located in like a mobile setup here kind of right now um, out, of, out of state. And um, I've said that uh, most likely making a move here actually back up north. So it's been a kind of, cha kind of a chaotic couple of weeks um, for everything going on here. So... But I think all that's still going to plan, but I'm not too sure, actually. Things might be kind of changing back to we're staying potentially worth where I'm at now. It's just been a it's been a crazy couple weeks. So, but I do, I do uh, really appreciate you guys just following along with the videos and everything and all the love and support, all the comments and everything. I do read every single comment. I try to respond to as many of them as I can and everything, but the comments we have got, we have been getting a lot more comments, which is always amazing. Honestly, just like I said, so awesome. I really appreciate it. So thank you all so much. For that it honestly like i said just just means so much to me but um you guys are absolutely so amazing always so supportive of everything and saying hopefully uh, hopefully everything goes good on your move and the drive and everything and uh, just like i said you guys are always just so amazing and so supportive of whatever i'm doing so like i said I, I just honestly it means the world to me so thank you all for that i really appreciate it um we got 14 for you thank you yeah, we've got a lot of items going out here again, as always, which is always a good thing, though. But at the same time, that means that we're going to be getting lower on some other items, too. Yeah, in the store, that shelf looked like a normal, like, uh, fruits and veggie stand. So I thought maybe that was just, like, a smaller one. But unfortunately, that's not the case. So we kind of botched that, but it's only eight, at least it was only 80 bucks. Not, uh, excuse me, not too bad. But, um, yeah, I think the storm's over, so I guess I could just turn down the game audio just slightly, too. We have a lot of people lining up, though, here. I think with us leveling up again, we gain some more customers rolling through here for the day. Which, again, I do hope, which maybe by the time this video goes live, maybe by the time our following video goes live, maybe we'll have another update for this game that'll include some employees or even a self-checkout or something to help us speed things up for the store. But it is getting very chaotic 
and um, it's getting very hard to keep up with everything but you guys are absolutely loving this loving this uh, game and it's absolutely killing on the channel so like i said thank you all for that we're gonna keep on rolling with it um for the me in the meantime here 13 bucks for you it's kind of cool going from this back to supermarket sim and just kind of comparing the two and everything and doing the two on the channel at the same time as well it's always awesome but uh, we got 450 for you thank you appreciate it all right this is perfect uh, we got 20 and 1 for you. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. We got your card there. 19 bucks. Thank you. All right. We got 2 and 25. There we go. Yeah, I do apologize as well. I know some of you guys have been asking about where's the face cam and such. And like I've said, I am being at a mobile setup. I did not bring my face cam with me. Only my laptop and a monitor to play on. So I will be, whenever I get back to my normal setup with the face cam, we'll be coming back. I know we've got some new viewers and stuff. Um, on, the, on these videos, each and every video, we gain new subscribers pretty much. So that is absolutely awesome. And like I said, thank you all for the love and support. All the new subscribers and everyone that's been around here since the beginning and everyone in between. I appreciate you and sticking around for the tough times and the good times. But um, yeah. All right. Uh, we've got 24, 25... Yeah, some of, you, some of you guys might even not even know that we do a face cam normally. Um, if you don't watch any of the other vid older videos of this. If you're just watching ahead. Or the current ones in ahead. 36 and 50. We got 425. I would like to get at least over 2 grand. Try to kind of... Oops. Try to kind of make some money today in, in preparation for our following um, store level here. That we can hopefully get in the following episode. But I don't know. We will see with all of that. Um, yeah, we are... Yeah, I was going to say, we are definitely going to be out of some things here, but that's all right. If we run out of something, I think that actually got changed now. So when we run out of things, we the prices do not change, which I, I want to try and test that theory again, because we did that in a lot yesterday's episode, in the last episode, if this video doesn't go live right away. Um, but we did that in the previous episode of this, and it actually seemed like prices stayed the same, which I would, I didn't see that anywhere in the patch notes, but I I guess it that, that changed. I'm not sure. 50, there we go. We got 11, oh, whoops, 11.75, there we are, 7.75, we have $8, all right, we finally got caught up actually on our customers, and yeah, we are out of cabbage, which we have some, we just don't have it on the shelves, so we may as well get some out, why not, we've got it, let's, let's make use of our inventory of it, gotta get some watermelons and some of the, um, Pumpkins out as well. Um, okay, we're going to do a little bit of restock, midday restock here while we're rolling with things. And then uh, pumpkins. Got one here. And we'll grab one more box of this right away and get, it, get them on out there. Empty it out. Try to keep on rolling for this night, through this night here. Okay. All right, let's try to fly through some of these people here. Get them checked on out. There we go. We got 2350. Thank you. Appreciate it. Not even going to say it. <laughs> you guys already know what's up. All right. We got 28 and 50. Three bucks we got. Thank you. Appreciate it. Uh, we got $11 for you. There we go. We have 21. There we are. We got 4 and 50 for you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Got 26, 25. All right. And no change. Perfect. We got we got over $2,000 already, so that is awesome. I also want to check up on our prices real quick. Did any of these change it? See, they do not. They have not changed. Because where's... Yeah, there's our cabbage. So that is, that did get updated finally. Then. That is awesome. So we don't. Have to, we no longer have to worry about if we run out of something, the price is changing on us. We can just do our own thing, restock it if we, if we do. If we are completely out of something. Obviously, we just kind of maybe might forget where it's actually placed on the shelves. Which is not good, but it is what it is. Uh, 39 and 25. Thank you. All right, we got 850. We should probably Well, I guess let's, we'll stay open for a little bit longer here. What are we out of there? Shoot. See now this is where I don't know what we're actually out of. Just what I was 
Oh, you know what? I think it's, um, is it coconuts? Yeah, I think it's coconuts that go there, actually, isn't it? Nope, not coconuts. Wait. Oh, no, it's avocados then, isn't it? Oops. Which we do have some avocados. Not many. Yeah, it's gotta be avocados then. Yeah, it definitely was avocados. Okay. This one is on my list. So I think we're gonna check out a few more people here and then we'll probably close up shop for the day and we'll get a restock in here and try to keep on rolling from there. There we go. We got your card there for you, sir. 3825, thank you. Appreciate it. We've got 12 and 50 for you. 13.50, all right. I think we're gonna, yeah, I think we're gonna close up shop for the day then. Store is closed. <laughs> okay, anyways. Got a few things for you, thank you, ma'am. Appreciate it, 5.75. Just these, thanks. We got 11 and 50, and there you are. And that is the last customer in here for the night. Let's see what we got going on with everything here. Try to get a re restock up on everything that we have for our boxes. And then we'll obviously reorder everything. Kind of do our do our thing that we do with everything. And keep on rolling for the day. We got... What the cluck? <laughs> Didn't, I never noticed that until now. That is actually really funny. I almost ran that this box outside of the dumpster. No, we don't do that. We Wait, that's right. This goes over here. Um, is that? Yeah, that is it. Okay. Breakfast biscuits right there. We don't really need any more of those here currently. Uh, caster sugar. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm guessing we're going to need some of those. Probably get another box or two of those right away while we're at it. So we got some granola here. There we go. We got some brown sugar oatmeal. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, I think our... I think our way of stocking things up is kind of a the most efficient way that at least in my opinion that you can get um here for now yeah here we go okay got one thing left over from there we'll get these brought out whoops um move that over i guess we really didn't need to do that but that's all right I'm trying to keep these Kind of in order here. Makes sense of things. Uh, we got some of these, though. Here we go. Got some of the rice. We should honestly be fairly decent for a lot of this stuff, though. Got one left of that. I'm very tempted just to toss that since we have one left of it. But at the same time, we it's kind of a waste to do that. We really don't need to do that. Uh, all right. There is that. We already went through another card of things. Again, let's get our um, shelf, everything placed back out here. There we go. Let's see here. I think, yeah, we're down to these now. Trying to make a, do a restock as fast as we can to keep things rolling for the episode as well. Try to be as efficient as we can, but obviously it's a, it's a little tricky sometimes. There we go. Let's get all of these in here. Got some beers. Okay. Got some of these. There we go. Let's see here. Look at that, perfect. We got a dust storm rolling in. Okay. I think that's everything for this cart then. It's interesting to see that the dust makes its way into the building here when it's, whoops, when it's a closed sealed, built, sealed building. Definitely is interesting with that. I don't know why that's a thing, but it's interesting nonetheless. Barely snuck that one in. Um, there's that. And then we got these right there. And then we got to obviously go over the fruits and veggies and then ordering stuff. And we should be about good to go from there then. Got some milks. We really don't sell a ton of milks anymore. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's our pricing or what. But it is very weird. The amount that we sell of those only. 
Okay. Probably shouldn't have placed this card as close as we did. Let's back that up a little ways. Here we go. Some of you guys were saying that we really should reorganize the fruits and veggies as well, which I do agree with. I think we need to. Uh, we just need to, I guess, suck it up and just do it some time here. Probably would help us with, oops, with our place, like trying to re restock stuff. Probably would be helpful for that. Here we go. Got some bananas here, which we sold one. That entire day we sold one banana, really. That is it. Uh, watermelons. Yeah, we got a couple. Either way, we're going to a couple of those. We're going to need another thing of cabbage. Try to fill things up here. Okay. There we go. Um, not very many empty boxes, though, which is a good thing, I guess. That means that we're stocked up on things. But at the same time, uh, we've got quite a few empty spaces still. Some mangoes. No, we don't have any more mangoes. Cucumbers. Okay. Last box to go through here then of what's in our storage room and then we can start going through our ordering process as well. All right, we got apples, cucumbers. Got some more of them here. All right. Got some red bell peppers, some of our new peppers. Guess we really didn't need a ton of those since we're not really selling much of them, but that's all right. Got some onions here. And then some pumpkins. And there we go. That is everything all at least checked over with our stock of things that we have here currently. I right, see so we still need to order ah, we still need to order things on up here. All right. Whoops. <laughs> Don't know why I did that, but that's all right. All right, let's go ahead get them get some things ordered on up again when we ever whenever we order some we order doubles of it. There we go. One, two, one, two. Actually, you know what? Bananas we don't need. I know that for a fact. Coconuts, we probably could use some. Breadsticks, we could use some. Some of these, some of those. Yeah, again, I think this is the best, most efficient way that we can order, order products and keep things in stock. Honestly, I don't think we need watermelons either. Hmm. One thing I actually want to order more of is... Let's see. These guys, and then one more of these. I think it would be helpful. Okay. Alright, there we go. Let's go ahead and just get things stocked on up here then. Got all these, all of our lovely yellow cakes. Should be able to get these shelves just about full. I think that was exactly perfect. Couldn't have asked for a better situation there. But yeah, we're just under 2,000, so honestly not bad. We made about a thousand bucks here so far. Okay. Got some Mr. Wash, washing powder, and then some of our be lovely bean soup that we've got. And there we go. Okay. So there's that. That's actually a really good order. We are basically about empty on everything perfectly. And we have two boxes with a few things in them. And the rest of it's empty. So that is awesome. Gotta love that efficiency. Because honestly, I'd rather just order stuff than keep things in our storage room at this point. It's a lot easier to go over things when we order stuff and, like I said, instead of just ordering, or instead of having stuff sitting in our storage room waiting for us. Um, these go... Wait, where are... Oh, right here. <laughs> Duh. Alright, there we go. There's that one. We got this guy. 
top this one off as much as we can. We'll be about good to go with that. Got some more cabbage. I know we didn't need much of that, but again, it's a good idea to have them than not. Okay, we're all good on those. Coconuts. I was going to say, I think we're about good on those, but actually not, not so much. Actually lower than I thought. I hope we ordered some peppers. I see our red bell peppers are a little bit low. Um, let's set this guy over here. We're a little bit less efficient with the fruits and veggies. But that's okay. Okay. Um, let's get these. Got a few of these. And then some coconuts. And we got another order here. I know we got more of these coming to one more box. Same with another box of crackers. Okay, good. There's our peppers. Alright, so there is that. Set those guys down right there. Yeah, we're getting really low on these. Yeah, I'm glad we ordered another box of these. Actually, that's going to be about perfect. For another shelf worth. Um, yeah, these go right back here. Same with these. Definitely always need more of the box stuff. We could probably use some more of those crackers, actually, which I know we didn't order any of them, because I did see that they were not in the red as far as the inventory count. So we did not order any of those. But that's all right. Uh, we got some chopped tomatoes. Gonna have some extras of those, but that, again, is okay. It is good having more than enough, honestly, but at the same time, I just, I like the efficiency of not having extra stuff. If we can, I like the cleanliness of only doing just the bare essentials. Actually, had a lot of empty boxes there, though. I guess it was because it was all, like, the big box stuff, like the crackers and toaster pastries things. Yeah. Okay. Here is, I think, our last order, or second to last. I guess we didn't really need pumpkins. I think we're okay on pumpkins still. We have, well, like, one extra box, I think, of them right now. I think that's our last order, actually. Um, yeah, pumpkins we're good on. Crackers we know we need more of. There we go. Same with these. We know we need them for the top shelf here. We got half a box that so we still could use of those, which... Eh. Not too concerned about. There we go. We got some more extras of those in. We got some red apples, which go right here. Okay. There we go. Do a little spin around. Got some more pumpkins here, which I think we... Yeah, we got some up there already, but that's all right. These will go over here by the rest of our drink section. And we'll throw these away, and um, we should be able, to be about good from there. So we got about another thousand bucks made today, and honestly, a pretty short amount of time. We've got, actually, we should do some chips and um, caster sugar. We should order some. Let's see here. Chips and the sugar, which I think guess we passed by. Yep, there it is. Yeah, let's get these ordered up real quick. Get them delivered. Could use some extras for sure. And other than that, I'm not really seeing any... I guess we could. We probably could order another box of the crackers. Try to help us out with that. Same with the chocolate powder. We probably could use some extra of that. Hmm. Well, it is what it is. It will, we'll be alright. Again, I'm not as concerned now about running out of items. Being that they do not reset price. So that is a huge help for us. A huge plus. So I will take that as a huge W. And, um, yeah... Okay, so there's that. But yeah, I think that's going to be a good point to wrap up this episode here, guys. So if you guys enjoyed this, be sure to drop a like in the video. Show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around you checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But yeah, we're going to come back in the next episode. We're going to work towards getting our next door level. Hopefully get our next door level in the following episode. We will see on that. But um, yeah, that's going to do it for this one, guys. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out, guys.